Hello, and thank you for watching. My name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. I'm here to create videos for you to help you understand QuickBooks slightly better than you currently do. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please put them in the chat box. Thank you. Hi, my name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. In today's video, I want to show you how to change the email address that you use to sign into your QuickBooks Online account. We've all had situations where we thought we picked the right email address and then life happens and we change our email and you want to be able to change the email address that you use to sign in. So let's do that together. I have a QuickBooks Online account that I set up using the email address racheltraining at gentlefrog.com. This email address doesn't actually exist and so I want to change it. So I'm going to go ahead and select sign in. I'm going to type in my password. So what I tried to do initially and what you might try to do is I tried to change it in account and settings. And this definitely does change my email address, but it doesn't change my sign in email address. You saw just a moment ago that this is not the email address I used to sign in. I want to change my sign in email address. So I'm going to go ahead and close this. What I'll do instead is click on the R in the upper right hand corner, the R representing Rachel. I'm going to go ahead and select manage your Intuit account. So over here, there's information about profile. I'm going to skip that. I'm going to zip down to sign in and security because what I really want to do is change my sign in. So right now my user ID is Rachel training. My email address is Rachel training. Let's go ahead and start with the user ID. I'm going to click on the line and I'm going to change it. I'm just going to replace it with the word training. So it just says training. So that's updated. And now down here, the email address, I'm going to go ahead and change that. The training email, by the way, is a valid email. But if you want to get a hold of me, my email address is rachel at gentlefrog.com. All right, that's it. So now when I go to sign in, I'll be able to sign in using my um, my email. I'll send a verification just so I have that for later. But let me sign out and sign back in just so we can verify that this worked. So it remembers my old ID. I'm going to say use a different ID. And fantastic, it worked. I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them below. If you'd like to reach out to us for help, we offer bookkeeping as well as training services, and we can be found at gentlefrog.com. Thank you so much.